zero percent chance for the rest of the day. He said it's just left in and he'll put it up into the walls when we get Yeah, he's been working up here for a little bit without us. So we need to get our batter boards up. And this is our line that we need to stay established with because he's got his footing dug to it. Yeah. Big rectangle then? Pretty much, and it's got a garage 45 off of it. It's got a bunch of jogs that kind of follow his thing here. But then there's a garage wall that is 45 to it. it comes out here somewhere yeah and the garage is kind of squared up to the road a little bit more a little bit different here it's monday everybody it was dumping this morning i get all these messages this morning is it a rain day is it a rain day i'm like no dude it's gonna stop raining this is just mist yeah but it's winter time. It's time to start slipping and sliding. I'm sorry. Nothing I can do about it. Here comes the sunshine, I can already hear the birds chirping. Brick, get off the string. Ow. Hang the string up. You better get used to this. This is our working conditions for the next three or four months, man. Look. You there? Look. That fish. 80 foot half inch. Get the front. 80 foot half inch, go to the other corner. Pull it. A little short. About three eighths. Okay. Mm -hmm. Short this way. So Eight this needs to now. grow this way still. So there we should have went. We're going to go another little bit here. it for today or pick it up and go home got most of the forms up except for this one wall and nothing in the garage oh man it was just one of those days kind of where just dragging myself included low energy drag monday well, things will be better tomorrow. This is a pretty nice spot. We're up on the cliff. It's just too foggy to get to get the sun today. Back to work tomorrow. Yay. It's concrete. It's what I know. I've had countless years 
walking through it, rodding it over, leveling it out, floating it, shaping it, grooming it, hosing it off, sealing it up. Countless projects from house foundations to park benches, even city signs out of solid concrete. You can follow me and my crew as I log what we're doing, how we do it, and just us playing goofing off sometimes. Pulled out yet? Oh. Everybody was here on time, except for me, I was four minutes late. Do some filler boards and grading. Filler boards? What do you think, Chet? Get them. Yeah. If he can make himself useful. Let's go back home and try it again tomorrow. <laughs> Not happening today. Okay. Tried it again. Plus, Damn it's it. double annoying when you don't have any hair on your face. <laughs> oh, can't even stand you. <laughs> can't even look at you. Eight and a half. That's pretty much the whole thing. He's got to come down a little bit. He wants four inches of capillary. So four inches of, of concrete is four inches. Plus four inches of rock is eight inches. Plus two inches of foam. That's ten inches, Jet. No. I think we're I think we're gonna end up rolling it this way. So only that side there. Breaks over. We have this all cut down to the proper depth. We're gonna put in three to four inches of capillary break, which is that rock out there. It has no fines in it. It's almost like a little filter for if the groundwater gets up to there, it can kind of, you know, filter back down. It doesn't just soak it up. I guess that's the idea. I am not an engineer, but that's my understanding of it, Chad. Go there, Big D. <laughs> Gotta get a shot of the man in there. Foot fix it. Good yeah. you hope you don't work up a sweat uh, doing that. Yeah, <laughs> Chad, I had to strip uh, down. Uh, yeah, well, I think we got to get this over with. We got places to be. Sorry, Chad. Ah, it's happening.
I use a little bit here. Was this, how was this, Chad? Was this fine or? You were just there. I know. You don't remember? It's pretty much right on? Yeah, pretty much. So that means that's a hole then. Explain it to the people. Tell the people what you were thinking. Pick a task and complete it, man. Ow. Get off of my steak. Oh, dude. What happened? I threw your, I threw your elbow out of Oh, it. dude. Did anybody see that? <laughs> it's being Dave taped. just hit me with a hammer. I got it on oh. tape, yeah. Dude. Oh, shit. Never mind. <laughs> Never uh, mind. I'll save that one for later. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> he, he touched my arm. I've been assaulted. Working scum. You just touched my finger. Ah! <laughs> <sighs> so what we have here, batterboard's super high. Our stakes are going to be tall. So I've plumbed this up right in line with the stake line so we can hang an additional string line down here double string line keep all our stakes nice and plumb Whoa, Chad. Chad, get the level. Chad the moon's out in the middle of the day I know it's just the reflection it's actually underneath us so that we're looking up at water and that's a reflection in the water Okay, it's dead. I'll tell you that right Dude, now. Dude, you smell like hummus again. <laughs> and why aren't you wearing one of my t-shirts? I just gave you like four new shirts. I got it in the truck. I was going to put it on, but I didn't want to cut the sleeves off. I don't care what you do to it. They're work, they're work shirts. in the jackalope <laughs> world's most dangerous animal Dang. Hmm. <laughs> dude a boss is just is like here. kalua or something no yeah i guess let's pick it up we'll go to my house get ready for tomorrow Ted's got the idea. We're gonna put some walls up and yeah, get some walls in. Get some rebar on there. Get some rebar. Right. All the number four bar in. And mm -hmm. I mentioned to Ted, big guy, if we put in uh, a couple number four bars and all the structural footings mm -hmm. on Dobies, probably smart to do that before we do any insulation. Get the footing still in because that around all the edges, I'm putting in that thin mylar. Right. And it'll tear up if we're in there too much. So hopefully, hopefully between today and tomorrow, we'll be getting close. I think so. Yeah. Yep, and then we're back into some rain potentially after that, but tomorrow, at least yeah. tomorrow's beautiful. Tomorrow should be good. Then we get our butts kicked. Yeah. For sure. But then that, the following week, it looks nice. We can schedule a pour for the following yeah. week or something. Next week looks really good. Yeah. Get all the loose stuff out of the footings and start putting some rebar in. What's the lesson here, kids? Did you learn a lesson? Should have backed up and did it again. So he couldn't have collected no money. No, no, no. No, Dakota. What do you call this place, Simon? I don't know. We call this place, I don't know. Idaho. Um, this is called, I don't know, Idaho. No, it's just Idaho. 
Uh, this is uh, on the way down to Klamath. It's a little pull out before you get to the trees of mystery. It's gonna it's gonna eat up some yards here and I, I didn't even do the math on this wall here yet we could be pushing 70 on this one because that was my initial figures was 30 in the slab 30 in the footings it's fine i'll have them send us 54 and as we dump out that 54 we'll have a better idea of, of what we need to, uh, to finish it up if 54 is not looking like it's gonna make it we'll just batch another one out all right, we're ready as we're ever gonna be. We'll be pouring this here momentarily. I'm tired. I want to go home. But the concrete's not done yet. Really, the only part that is done is the first load. 
second load isn't quite done and then it gets wetter and wetter as you get down the line it's kind of cold out cloud cover no sun short days gonna run the rider trowel around it one more time unload that uh, then the rest is gonna be either crazy trowel or um, walk behind power trowel and we are gonna have it finished before the sun goes down finishing in dark no good it's 4 407 I'll probably be here till 5 dang it Chet <laughs>